Hello, in this Windows 10 tips and tricks video, we're going to show you the difference between desktop and tablet mode. As the name suggests, desktop is oriented more towards a desktop and laptops, and tablet mode is more oriented and designed for tablets. But what I think is great about both modes is they work on, like a desktop works on a tablet, tablet mode works on desktop, and they also have use cases as well. It's not like they work and you'll never use them. For example, I've got a gaming machine that I've built and it's hooked up to my TV and I use the tablet mode on it. And the reason I use it is it's got big icons. It's very simple. It allows me to easily navigate it. If you're wondering, I use a 360 controller to actually navigate it so I don't actually use a keyboard and mouse. And for something like that, the tablet mode is fantastic. So it does have use cases on a desktop PC and a desktop PC will have use cases on a tablet PC because you can just do more with it. So to switch between different modes, all you do is go and click the notification button right here and just click tablet mode, that's it. So I'm gonna click tablet mode. It's now changed to tablet mode. This is the start screen and the desktop essentially because if I click on this, I can't go to any sort of desktop. So if I were to open up an app, or open up an application, it's gonna open up the weather. So let it load up. And it loads up like so. There isn't a desktop behind it, so if I click the start button, it takes me back to this start screen. If you've used Windows 8, you'll feel right at home with this because this is essentially what Windows 8 was obviously they had a desktop as well but the tablet mode doesn't have a desktop form and we've got this little button right here which is the equivalent of let's just disable tablet mode so to disable it just go to notifications disable tablet mode like so it's the equivalent of this bar right here so I'm just gonna go back to tablet mode so like saying, this is the equivalent of part of the start menu or the traditional start menu in Windows 7 and older Windows. This is just a simple power button, so sleep, shut down, restart. And this is just all of your applications. You can search as you would normally. You can use Cortana and you can also multitask as well. You can't have desktops in tablet mode, but if, for example, I've got the weather open, I'm also going to open up Microsoft Edge. So we opened up two different applications. I'm gonna to switch to desktop mode and the applications are still open. They don't restart. I don't have to log out or restart my computer to switch between desktop and tablet. That is great. So I can just quickly switch between them and do what I need to do. So that's the difference between desktop and tablet mode for Windows 10. If you have any questions, feel free to post them on sonarlearning.co.uk forward slash questions.php. There'll be a link in the description. Please rate, comment, and subscribe for more great Windows 10 videos. And as usual, thank you for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful day.